She says art is a great way to express one's emotions without words, and it is also a means to process complex feelings to find relief. Art also helps develop entrepreneurial skills for students so they can produce quality products and sell them to make a living. They are at the most creative. Uh, you can't prescribe them what a little stock monkey looks like, you know, and uh, they simply draw the monkey and you may not ask them what is that. Never ask a child what is that. They must tell you what did you draw now, you know, and they will tell you in detail all the things. So start as soon as possible. Put that crayon and that thing. Don't worry about scribbling on walls because uh, that is where it all starts off. And it helps your, start, your child with emotional development. It helps your child with uh, fine motor skills. Christelle Stergiard is a teacher says she has observed behavioural changes since a child joined the class. It's like my kids absolutely love just getting quiet and being relaxed. The atmosphere in which they do the arts at Irene's is like such a friendly, warm, calming environment. And um, I think, you know, in order to have a healthy child, you need to be balanced, you know, like a little bit of art, a little bit of music. This is what the students had to say. I'm a much happier person. I look forward to my classes on a weekly basis. Um, I look at art differently as well, and I enjoy it. I enjoy looking at the colors. I enjoy uh, buying the, the paint and the acrylic and the brushes. It gives me actually a lot of joy in that sense. My, yes, mental health is very important, and through art, I think I, I heal myself um, in many ways. I love art so much. I don't know, it's just relaxing and calming for me. It's this, it's where I can relax and... The Barn Art Studio was established in 2010. Today it has 60 members between the ages of 4 and 60.